Wednesday. Uh, I just want to say a couple of things before I get into my video. Number one, Amanda you did an amazing job on Monday. I really enjoyed your video and anyone who's watching this always show lots of love in Amanda's videos because she's completely new to this and she's doing such a good job not just with the video content but editing and everything. It's been so good and <laughs> number two. You may have noticed on this channel we haven't talked about themes. That's because we decided we're all very thoughtful people and we're not very good at sticking to specific themes. So we've just kind of kept them pretty broad and we'll just see how it goes in the future what we'll talk about and hopefully you'll stick around to find out. So in Amanda's video on Monday she was talking about making New Year's resolutions which is a way of changing your year to how you want to change it. But in my video I'm going to talk about how your year will change out of your control. That's right, I'm talking about horoscopes. Something I don't actually believe in. But I think if you're going to be a sceptic about something you may as well research it. So that's what I've done. The reason I'm so sceptical about it is because there's so little zodiac signs and there's so many people under each one that I don't see how predictions for their future can be specific to each individual person. So I went to loads of websites and I've gotten predictions for 2011 for each sign of the zodiac and then I've checked for trends which match the websites that agree with what each other is saying and that's what I'm going to read to you right now. So if you're watching this video please watch it and take it under consideration and then let's all completely forget about everything I've said until the end of the year and then I've got it all written down so I'll be able to direct you guys back to this channel, this video at the end of December or the start of January and we'll see if any of our predictions came true. Isn't that exciting? Yes! My zodiac sign is Virgo if you're wondering as is Amanda's and Christina's is Aries. So please tell me your zodiac sign in the comments and also whether or whether or not you believe in horoscopes and future predictions of that kind. Okay! Sorry for the dramatic lighting change, it started to rain outside and then it got really dark. Okay, so if you're in Aries, it says you're going to have really bad headaches in the summer and skeptic me is saying obviously it's hot in the summer, you get headaches but not going to be judgmental, we're just making predictions. And it also says that you're going to have a really crazy year, there's going to be so much happening and it's just going to be really, really hectic and mad. Epic camera angle change. I just said, oh I have to turn the light on because it's raining and it's really dark and then the sun came out. <sighs> I wonder does it say in my horoscope that I'm going to have really bad trouble with lighting in my across one sky videos. Okay. So if you're a Taurus, you're going to have increased cash flow between March and June. Um, romance in the autumn and your life will be completely transformed this year. How exciting. Gemini, um, you'll have hidden costs to pay. There'll be family issues in August, sorry. And this will act as a smooth transition year for the next chapter of your life. <laughs> Leo's, Leo the Lion, you will travel. Um, you'll have a secret admirer during the Christmas. You will have high blood pressure. Sorry. Okay, so Virgos, this is me and Amanda. Uh, you will receive unearned money this year. In November you will make an important career decision. There will be romance between February and April and you will have trouble sleeping. Pretty cool, I think. Um, Libra's debt may consume you in the first half of the year, but then you will have a good financial year from then onwards. Scorpios, there will be confrontation with work colleagues and you will have good fortune towards the end of the year. I think that meant money wise. Sagittarius, I think I said that right, sorry if I didn't. Um, artistic talents are brought forward this year. Expect promotion in November or December and stagnant friendships will come to an end. Oh. Capricorn, you'll have to work longer hours this year and but your finances will improve. Well that's kind of one link to the other. I didn't really think about that when I wrote that down, sorry. Um, Aquarius, you'll find love at a theme park. Go to a theme park and your health is better this year than last year. If you were very healthy last year, I don't know what's going to happen this year, but it can only get better. And PCs, you have a desire to be independent at work. PCs, there weren't so many for that, I couldn't find trends, so I do apologise. 
I hope you enjoyed my first video. I'm looking forward to see if any of these come true, but we have to wait 12 months. Christina, I'm really looking forward to seeing you on Friday.